Wendy Risk is all about butterflies, from her clothes to her car, everything is about this colorful insect. It's one reason that her friends call her the butterfly whisperer. She just wishes that there were a few more around her home. Then news reporter Bobby Lewis is on the road in Pinellas Park, where a woman is doing everything she can to get monarchs to come back home. And it's almost time for the blanket flowers to come out. It's been over a year since it crumpled, but Wendy hole. Risk still misses her mango tree. I was lucky it went down between my house and my neighbor's house. Hurricane Irma stripped Wendy's backyard of its mango maker. Broke my heart. Which served as much more than just a tree. All my butterflies disappeared. Its leaves were home oh. to her butterflies. Look at that. Wendy Risk has always loved the beautiful bugs. It's not ready to fly yet. Ever since her dad introduced her to Michigan's monarchs as a kid. I'm pretty crazy about butterflies. For decades, she's raised them, even inside her house. The colors are beautiful. Hundreds All gathered in her Pinellas Park backyard. That is, until the storm. I used to have flocks of 12 and 24. One time I just lay on the grass and I took pictures and I got pictures of butterflies flying in the air. Now she's trying to bounce back and bring the butterflies back. They're coming back slowly, slowly, slowly. Milkweed helps, so does constant gardening. I try to do two hours a day. She's a woman willing to do whatever it takes to attract those beautiful creatures. Oh, look, here's a caterpillar. Back home. He's eating that leaf down. That's his job. The goal is simply to save the butterflies. If I have more, that's absolutely wonderful. I don't care if it's a baby being born or a kitten or a butterfly. It still just does your heart good, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's a big part of my life. You could tell she loves them, huh? <laughs> yeah, the joy that it brings to her life. Yeah. Oh, amazing. So Wendy's parents introduced her to butterflies during family camping trips in Michigan. She moved to Pinellas Park in 2004. Wendy says that butterfly gardens are becoming more popular in Central Florida. She speaks at her local garden club to teach neighbors how to attract butterflies.